Yeah, my boy Hemi Lifestyle about to get the mid muffers cut. Put them mini race Sir, bullets man. in there. That joint about to sound like a beast, yeah, yo. Man. Look at that. I'm telling you, mini race bullets is the best thing you can put on there. No cap. Nothing else, bro. No, nothing else. That's it. Trust me. That, I had that on an RT. Everything. Mm -hmm. You gonna hear it. You gonna hear it. Shit looking good. His car, basically bar car, but green. And he has stripes on the front now. And I don't. Shit look clean. All right, so the job is done. It's my boy Richie doing the job. Shout out to my boy Richie. Get you right every time. You wanna see, you see what we looking like under here? For all your car needs. Make sure you check them out. Right. <laughs> he said gotta make noise. Atlantic <laughs> Avenue, 1798. There we go. Well, actually, Fulton, I'm sure. There's the address. Let's hear what it sounds like in a few. Get back to y'all in a second. Nah, he's hilarious, yo. Nah, son, that's hilarious, bro. Yoni, bro. <laughs> when she's on the way down, we're going to hear how this sound in a second. <laughs> Yo, that nigga is funny, son. We're going to hear how this sound in a second. This joint going to be loud. Headphone warning. Got yeah. the leg maker and the mini race bullets. It's gonna sound amazing. Mm -hmm. And yeah. Other than that, stock Hellcat. Yeah, how this sound? That's it. Sounds good. SRT Joe, SRT Joe, cleaning it up. What's going on, guys? SRT Joe back. About to install the catch can on this. So, catches all the bad oil, or well, some of the bad oil, not all of it. But, you know, I'd rather some than none. So, let me get the instructions real quick. Cat back looking clean, man. Looking clean. Got the intake on there. JLT. I'll at me. Right, after 30 minutes of freaking getting pissed off, I finally got it on there. Man, this thing made me curse. It's not because it's hard. The engine's hot, so and I'm impatient, so those things don't mix. So, well, 30 minutes later, a couple burnt burns on the hand. And it's on there. That's what happens when you're impatient and your engine's hot. But yeah, I finally got it on there. Sturdy. Understand? Got that. Just gotta put this piece on here. And then that's it. And we'll fire her up in a second. Catch you guys in a second. Turns out I didn't break it. So that's good. like this usually doesn't go well for me last time i installed a thermostat on my charger rt let's just say i ended up on the back of a flatbed i'll put the pictures after this clip right here but she's running nice let me give you guys a couple revs real quick yes sir like a 
month later after I installed the catch can. And I'm gonna show you all the bad oil that's in there. Or the oil that you don't want going back into your supercharger at least. An oil catch can, well this style, it won't catch everything, but something is better than nothing. So let me grab this real quick. Put y'all down. Look at all that. See that? That's all the oil that would've went back into your supercharger. I don't really drive the car much. I mean, I probably drive the car maybe five, six times a month. But when I do drive it, I drive the shit out of it. I ain't gonna lie. So I'm about to give it a wash real quick. Got some stuff coming up today. And just give you guys a walk around, show you what's up. Cold start. Washing it up, looking all clean. I'm about to wash this beast next, but yeah. But when I before I didn't have the catch can, it used to do the, like this little stutter start, like it used to stutter before it started. I don't know how to explain it. But after I put the um the catch can on there, a few days later, it never did it again since then. I have, I think I have some clips of what it did before, so I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna show you guys what it do now. Yes, yeah, skate fire right up no stutter no nothing all right guys i'll catch you guys in the next one enjoy